Hey guys, it's Kwai Sierra World, and today we're going to be making a double layer yellow cake with chocolate frosting, so let's get started. To get started, let me just show you the ingredients that you're going to be needing. Okay, so first we're going to combine all of our ingredients except for the milk. So here is the flour, a dash of salt, our sugar, vanilla extract, baking powder, and don't confuse baking powder with baking soda. Baking soda comes in a box usually while baking powder comes in a can of some sort. And then our shortening. So we're just going to try to mix this all up now. Okay, so now I'm just going to get it to that consistency and then we're going to add our milk. And now just mix your milk in. Okay, so now my batter is all mixed up and it's very watery, but that's okay. And I'm just going to pour it into my pan. So make sure your pan is greased with cooking spray and I'm just going to pour in some batter. And I'm just going to repeat this with my other pan. So just place your cake in the oven using your pan pusher as always, like I always say. So this is what our cake looks like, and as you can see, it's really, really pretty. And I'm just going to run a knife around it and pop it out onto a plate. So do this gently and after your cake has cooled. And then it should pop out really easy. So this is the first layer of our cake here. And as you can see, it's very pretty. And I'm just going to wait for the second layer to come out. And then we can start building our cake. Okay, so now our second cake is out of the oven. And as you can see, it's perfectly round. And I don't want to touch it because it's really, really hot. We'll start building our cake as soon as it cools. Okay, so now the cakes have cooled and it's time to frost our cake. So I have my two layers there and um, the bottom of it kind of broke, but that's okay. And now I'm just going to do the middle first and then keep going. And the chocolate frosting is store-bought and it's like the Pillsbury kind. And I'm just using an offset spatula to spread this. And I'm just going to turn it like this so that it's easier to spread it on this flat side. Okay, so now that I have this middle part frosted, I'm just going to put my other cake on top. So now my cake looks like this, and I'm just going to do the top and sides of the cake. Okay, so now I have my cake all frosted, and I'm just going to cut into it now. So you can see on the inside there, there's a nice cake, and you can see the clear layers in it. And this cake was not the best for frosting, I have to admit, because it's such a light and airy cake. But let me just take a bite of it. And this is what it looks like. So as you can see, the cake looks really, really moist, and the frosting looks nice in it as well, so let me take a bite. So the cake is really good. Um... It was really fun to make this double layer cake, and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And my only complaint about this is that the frosting is a little rich, so maybe just use a different frosting. So yeah, and I suggest you don't eat this entire thing by yourself because there's a lot of frosting on it. So, hope you guys enjoyed. Bye.